previously on Alan Wake. Under the influence of the Dark Presence, I wrote a horror story that is coming true. Jagger had been my editor, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. Some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story. Together, we can create something absolutely wonderful. The Lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. My mom gave me this old light switch. The clicker. Alice is being kept in a dark prison. I need to find Cynthia Weaver to fix this. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. Well, we're expecting a record crowd from the neighboring counties. Naturally, we hope to break the record set by last year's Moose Fest in our neighboring town, Watery. Ladies and gentlemen, some people have asked me, what's the big deal about Deer Fest? And I think that this sums it up. It's about friendship and community. We've got a great party coming up, though. Uh, let's try to hold it in until tomorrow and get through the night in one piece, all right? Oh, we got locked up. I have it. Someone will come for it when the time is right. Thomas said so. He wrote it. The key is insurance. It's my job to keep it safe. Safe in the light. Mm. Always in the light. Hello. 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 I think that's the lady we need to find with a lantern. All the manuscript pages were gone. The FBI agent had taken them. I think... I think my tongue just took a crap in my mouth. Ugh. Oh, wait, we're in jail now? Oh, hell. Hell, this is not good. That about sums it up. It's one hell of a night. How do we get out of here? Oh, I am never drinking again. Hello? Uh, I need to talk to Weaver. She's the one in the song, the Lady of the Light. What, the crazy lady? Ugh, whatever you say, what Al, but we're stuck here. Like They're not Shh. gonna... Interviewed Wake. I had some reading to do first, Sheriff. And let me tell you, it was an interesting read. Well, I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. There's no way you're walking out of here. You hear me in there? Brett Easton Ellis, huh? Agent Nightingale, I want to talk to your superior. Well, we all want things, Sheriff. I wanted my... <sighs> Look, that's not possible right now. Agent Nightingale, I insist. <sighs> Wake, what's wrong? Lady, are you stupid? It's a trick. It's an obvious trick. Okay, I've had enough of this crap. Wake, I'm going to trust you with this. You're joking. Agent Nightingale, your opinion would matter more if you were sober and if I actually believed you were here on official business. Whoa! Get, get back in the cell, Stephen King. The only way you're leaving this place is over my dead... Wait a minute. I know this. Oh, my Oops. God. Oops. Oh, my God. Light. We need light. It's the only way to fight this thing. In my office. I've got your things there. Follow me. Oh, man. We're sitting... Nightingale tried to make sense of the manuscript. It was disjointed and strange. He didn't understand half of it. But it all rang true. Impossibly true. He took out his hip flask when he reached the page that described how he reached the page that made him take out his hip flask. It wasn't the booze that made his mind real. What? Any of you guys picking up the GTA trilogy, by the way? Looks really good. I'm uh, probably going to do a full playthrough of that. Let me know if you'd like to see those on the YouTubes or the Twitch. I think that comes out on the 11th of November. Here are your things. Wake, what do I need to know? What do you need from me? They can be hurt in the light, only in the light. And I need to find Cynthia Weaver. She can help me stop this. Light. Check. Cynthia. She lives in the old decommissioned power plant. I can get you there pretty quickly in the rescue chopper. Come on, let's get back to your friend. I managed to get hold of we Guardians are, of the I Galaxy as well. I was getting really good reviews. What? No. You can't reach the gate's control box from here. We need to get to the other side over the rooftop. I'll go. I'll open the gate for you once I'm across. You stay here in the light and cover me, Sheriff, okay? Got a lift there of some kind. And a ladder there. So yeah, I picked up Guardians of the Galaxy on the PC, the game. 
So if anybody wants to see any of that as well, don't forget to leave a like on the video and let me know in the comment section. I got this. Ah, oh, damn. That's smart. Good job, Wade. Okay, stick close. Our first stop is the town hall. The keys to the chopper are there. Oh, we make a good team, Sheriff. You uh, want to go out and grab a coffee after this? I actually looked at some old screenshots from Alan Wake on the 360 and release, and this does look so much better than the original game. Yeah, you kind of remember the older versions of games through like rose-tinted glasses and nostalgia. So looking at them side by side is, is a pretty huge difference. Going as fast as I can. I keep this for close encounters. Oh, Jesus, he nearly killed me. Oh, the big torch. Nice. Oh, helicopter key. Okay, Sheriff, I got the keys. Barry? Why isn't he inside? Oh, God. Oh, God. Barry, look out! Barry, move! He made it inside, Wake. He's okay. The storefront's blocked. Come on, Wake. Let's go around. We can meet him in the back. At least I know I'm not crazy now. Or are we all crazy? Well, the sheriff is on it. What couldn't she have been when be the rest of the game? The bookstore. Hey, Wheeler should be waiting for us in the backyard. Get the hell down or I'll call the sheriff. Oh, hi, Doc. I've got it. Don't worry about it. Sarah, about time somebody showed up. All the shooting in the air is idiotic. One of these days, they'll kill somebody. And over deer fest. I know. Go back to bed. He's got a point, Wake. Look, this town can't take this. It's me they want. The sooner I get out of here, the sooner you can all get back to life as usual. I hope you're right. Come on, let me get this door open. Wait, you got the keys to the bookstore? Perks of being the sheriff. A girl needs to get around. <laughs> they're really taking advantage of your presence here, Wake. I heard they're selling a lot of your Alex Casey books. Cynthia Weaver worked hard. Following her obsessive rituals, sometimes fighting them, always giving in to them in the end. She haunted the halls of Bright Falls' abandoned power plant. She marked her caches with light-sensitive paint that could only be seen by eyes that had been touched by darkness and saved by light like she'd been. 
She was preparing defenses and supply lines for the war she knew would come. The war between the forces of light and darkness. Hmm. Right now, I'm not a big fan of my own writing. I don't see Barry. Look, wait, maybe that's him. Oh, better that's be Barry. Put a secret here quickly. Oh, loads of good stuff. Okay, just what the doctor ordered. Let's get out of here. Canteen. Oh my god, the sheriff just saved my ass. I'll get that door open. Okay, it's open. Let's go, Wake. Wow. We keep them lit all night long on the night before Deerfest. Why? Well... It's tradition. For it to be free, the Dark Presence needed the writer to finish the story. Again and again, the story let it get frustratingly close to the writer without letting it capture him. It was bound by the events depicted in the manuscript. But it could pursue the writer indirectly, put others on the task, and stop those who would help him. It took over everything in its path, made them its puppets, and sent them after Alan Wake. We're almost there. We'll have to go through the basement to get to the parking lot. Yeah, there's no way going through the crypt will turn out to be a bad idea. Ah, uh, this ain't gonna be scary at all. Mm. Mama? The oh, Barry, uh -huh. nice. You didn't like that one? A tough audience. Well, I got plenty more. What? What are the Christmas lights for? Protection, man. Like garlic against vampires. Vampires. The helicopter's just across the parking lot and up the hill. Come on. The Bright Falls General Store is now my favorite place in the entire world. See this headlamp? It's like a superpower. I can just look at one of those things and they die. It's my flaming eye of Mordor. <laughs> I wish I didn't say that. Oh, God. Hey, I want a headlamp. Last one. Alice had screamed until she had no voice left to scream. Around her, the darkness was alive. It was cold and wet and malevolent and without end. She was a prisoner, trapped in the dark place. The terror would have burned her mind out, but one thing made her hang on. She could sense Alan in the dark. She could hear him. She could see the words he was writing as flickering shadows. He sensed her too. He was trying to work his way to her. Bastard. Yeah, I want a head torch. It make things so much easier. Unlimited power, full beams, permanent. And some Christmas lights wrapped around me as well, actually. With someone who may or may not have a pilot's license, you are cleared for departure to night springs.
Did we get him? Never gonna get used to this. The helicopter's just up ahead. I'll need a while to prep for takeoff. Don't take too long. I want to get out of here. God, I wish it'd stop doing that. Get them all! I panicked and wasted those. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's always the damn birds. Now we need to find our way through this place because we've got ourselves a little bit into trouble falling out of the helicopter. The power plant glowed in the night. It was close, but I had to find a way across. bad pushed him back into the electricity there okay i'm just gonna run uh Super dangerous around here. Oh, when the ambience does this, the lighting and the music freaks me out, man. More birds.
really hope this is <laughs> the, the, the right way. I've not just got back off on the same side. That'd be a little bit awkward. Safe haven. Yeah, it better be. Oh, hold it right there. Miss Weaver, Cynthia, I'm a friend. Prove it. Uh, you knew Zane, Thomas Zane. You're the lady of the light in the song. You can help me. About time. Young man, I've been waiting a very long time for you. Who? It's in the well lit room. Excuse me? What you need to drive the darkness back. The well-lit room is at the dam. I built the room to keep it safe. Will it help me find Alice? Will it get me back to the cabin? Fine, let's go. I can get my friends to come back with the helicopter. Oh, we won't go outside. Never at night. That's rule number one. You've been breaking the rules, young man, and where has that gotten us, hmm? No, I have a secret route, a lit route, an old water pipe. Something was damaged at the transformer yard. It's drained all the reserve power. Without it, the pipe will go dark. The power to the yard must be cut. Let me guess. You want me to do it? Young man, you're the one who likes to break the rules. I can't be outside in the dark. Ah, oh, Lady Weaver's the one with the yellow paint that's been marking everything and leaving stashes. She's got all the boxes everywhere, look. Ah. Yes, now it all please. begins to make Take sense. What you need. This is all for you, for the likes of us. We, we do Tom's work, don't we? Hurry! The switch is on the wall facing the shore. Easy. First time. Uh, uh, what? Who designs these things? <laughs> this way, young man. Follow me. Come, come. The pipe's empty now. We're ready to go. This okay. Way. We need to Let go. me just grab grab yeah, some things and gather myself. Coming. Bloody hell. I had such a crush on him. <laughs> such a beautiful man. I was jealous. There was a part of me that was maybe a little glad when she had the accident <laughs> and then tom started writing and, and woke the darkness up he tried to bring her back but you can't do that there are no free rides like that i'm starting to realize that in that case young man perhaps you're a smarter man than tom was the witch looked like her but it wasn't barbara was sweet he didn't understand until it was too late. He tried to undo it, wrote himself, her, everything he'd ever written out of the world. Oh, he was so famous. And afterward, no one knew. No, oh, Tom. He left only one thing behind in my game, in case it happened again. Insurance. He trusted me, or perhaps used me a little. Tom knew how I felt. Knew I wouldn't refuse him. I built the well lit room and put it there. It's been waiting for you. We are characters trapped in a story you have written, and none of us will survive to see the end if the darkness isn't stopped. She'll twist the story to her own dark ends. How do you know all this? Tom. That's the way he wrote it. He still talks to me, you know, in television, from beyond, from below. We have both been touched by the darkness, young man. He saved us both with light, but the darkness stays with you. 
leaves a stain. This pipe will take us directly to the well-lit room. Okay, I need to call my friends, tell them where we're going. Hello? Ow! Barry, we're headed to the dam in one of the pipes. Meet us there. Okay, I'll tell Sarah. It's Sarah now? Gotta go see if they're okay. They're probably dead. You must reach the well-lit room. This is no time to be a selfish idiot. That's my best friend! Well, be a fool. I'll use the pipe. I'll meet you at the dam if you make it. <laughs> Breaks his ankle. Well, that's a long way down. Okay. Hopefully, they are okay. The crash site looked bad, but as far as I could tell, the wreck was empty. All right, no corpses at least. More signs. Damn, she been busy. Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. I have a and leave? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, die, okay. Thanks for asking. I knew you'd be all right. How's that? The flaming eye of Mordor? Uh, laugh it up. <laughs> fine, man. Didn't we have somewhere to go? Weaver will meet us at the dam. Wake, call the elevator. I'm keeping watch. I, I hear something moving around. Get out, it's mine. You're not taking my supplies, Sheriff. crazy but she's got something zane left behind something to fix this gee could you be a little more vague thomas zane seriously might as well be paul bunyan or bigfoot yeah well he was real let's be careful okay oh jeez that's, that's a classic this. who'd leave that like that just the wrong way. What a waste of a car. Okay, wait. Enough. You will go no further. What? Stop. Stop. Oh, hell no. Probably shouldn't have grabbed that shotgun. You can't park that there. J 
Did y'all see that? Well done. I'm glad I was wrong. But it was a foolish chance to take. Don't worry about the noise. We're safe here. I have looked after the well-lit room for many, many years now. There is no shadow in the well-lit room. The power is fail-safe, and all the bulbs are numbered and changed regularly based on their make and model. So what you're saying is something's going to go wrong. Just because old Alan Wake here is there, it's going to all go tits up. There's an old army base at Raincoat Point, north of here. It was active during the Second World War. They operated here back then. They must have built this. Yes, they did. It's my place now. Well, oh, nice place you got. Oh, wait, what? My, oh, okay. Take it, and I won't need to worry about the room anymore, because 6 and 33 and 118 need changing soon, and I don't want to climb up the ladder to change them, because it's very late, and I'm tired. And if you take it, I won't have to do that anymore. The page was autobiographical, a memory from my childhood. But I didn't write this. It was a page written by Thomas Zane. None of them were supposed to exist anymore. Alan, seven years old, would fight sleep to the bitter end. When he did sleep, he soon woke up, screaming the nightmares fresh in his mind. One evening, his mother, sitting by his bed, offered him an old light switch. She called it the clicker, and flicking the switch would turn on a magical light that would drive the beast away. To imbue the talisman with all possible power, she added that it had been given to her by Alan's father. Alan never knew him, and anything of his took on mythical proportions in his mind. With the clicker firmly in his hand, Alan finally slept like a baby. Now, almost 30 years later, Alan thought of this. As he stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, the clicker in his hand, he took a deep breath and jumped. My mind swirled. I'd given the clicker to Alice, yet it was here. Zane had written it into existence, in a story I had written. I can get to her now. I can finish this. 